I know that it controls birth, and that is about it. I'm gonna guess that not that many guys know that much about birth control, at least hormonal birth control, just because it's usually women who have to deal with it. So we're gonna hit the streets of Hollywood today to see what guys actually know about birth control. Thank you for talking to us about birth control today. Oh, no problem. I'm gonna ask you a personal question. Okay. How much do you think you know about birth control? Uh, I'm more than most, but less than some. More than I'd, I'd like to. Because I've had too many close calls, you know? Absolutely nothing. All right, here's the first question. If you are trying to get a daily hormonal birth control pill, yeah. what do you need? Don't you need to be like 18? I don't know. Uh, a pill. Prescription? Yes. Yeah. You need a prescription. Yeah. That unless, is absolutely Unless right. you're getting it from like an online, like a creepy Chinese website or something like that. You may be able to find it on the black market without yeah. a prescription. That's true. If you are employing the rhythm method of birth control, what does that mean? Uh, maintain a certain stroke, speed, and velocity. You do what's called a cascarabi to your pills. You say, It basically means pulling out, not to be crass. I think it's about timing it with uh, the menstrual cycle and everything like that and making sure that when the female is ovulating that you're not procreating. Ding, ding, ding. Thank you, yes, thank you. I'd like to thank my fifth grade uh, PE and health teacher. Ready for the next one? Yeah. What does IUD stand for? You got me again. I have no idea. No guesses? Not one. Don't know. Do you know what an IUD is? Nope. Internal uterus damage? I don't know what it stands for, but I think it's implanted. No, it's, a, it's inserted, I would yeah. say. Yeah, interuterine device. So it's the thing that goes up into your cervix and prevents you from getting pregnant. That is almost exactly correct. It's intrauterine device. Is that like the ring? Is That's that... actually a different thing, That's but different the ring thing. is a thing. Close enough. All right, ready for the next question? Oh. Two common types of IUDs are the Mirena and the Paragard. The Mirena's made of plastic. What is the Paragard made of? Hopefully not metal. Or yes, metal. Good intentions? I don't know. Copper? It's copper. Yeah, okay. Would you shove something copper inside of you? No. The implant, uh, a small matchstick-sized rod which releases hormones, is placed inside what body part to prevent pregnancy? I'll go for uterus for 500. I feel like there's a loaded question that it is not the vagina. It's not the vagina. You're right. Then I don't know. I feel like I've seen my friends have it up here. It is actually in your arm. You're right. OK, one last question. No right or wrong answer. Would you take hormonal male birth control if it was available? Yeah, why not? As long as there's no crazy side effects. Yeah, because female birth control really kind of messes with your system, and I have, I have all the sympathy for girls that don't want to take it for those reasons. Sure, yeah, absolutely. I think it only be fair to, you know, spread the love, spread the hormonal imbalances. Do you feel like you learned anything today? Absolutely, yeah. I thought you were gonna school me and you kind of did. So the results were kind of mixed. Some guys knew way more than I thought they would and I was totally impressed. Ask me about sponges, let's go. I'll talk about sponges. I watched Seinfeld. And some guys were mystified by the entire thing. Because, I mean, your period's probably different from her period. How, how can you track it? One guy was so nervous, he literally ran away in the middle of being interviewed. So you guys don't use anything at all? Oh, oh uh, well, she's on the pill. She's on the pill. So you guys yeah. do use birth control? Yes. You don't use birth control. Come over here. You don't want to do it? Why not? Too much? But it seems like most guys would be open to the idea of taking a male hormonal birth control, which is pretty cool, because I feel like it's time for us to share that weight, you know? It takes two to tango, so might as well both put on our tango shoes, you know? We both need shoes. He needs shoes and she needs shoes.